Hello, this is Ekushan from Twitter. Today we're going to talk about um, compiling stuff uh, from Ast One Core. This is for uh, mostly Windows users that want to compile this to to use on their uh, PS uh, PS2 with the emulator or the or the PS4 or the um, or the PS5. So uh, we need uh, WSL or Linux. Uh, you can use a virtual machine if you if you want uh, pure Linux. Uh, but you, if you want uh, to use uh, something like Windows, you you can just use WSL or WSL2 or WSL uh, GUI. Uh, uh, you also need Python 3 and Python 3 uh, pip to install um, OKRager. OK and you also need uh, nano to edit the the bash uh, dot the dot bash rc or if you want to use v or vim you can use that as well but i'm not accustomed to to those so the first thing you need is the ps2 dev uh, toolchain uh, the pre-compiled binaries are provided in this in this link that i will put on the, on the description so uh, if you open up the folder you can see here the ps2 latest and greatest um, dev development toolchain which was compiled just like uh, uh, about half an hour ago uh, by the making of this video um, you need to go to user local you need to copy the um, the ps2 dev the dot tar dot kz there and then you, you just need to uh, sudo tar xvf uh, ps2 dev dot tar dot kz and it should install everything from the ps2 dev toolchain then you need to add these lines to the bash rc um, script so you can just open the, the linux shell here and if you um, if you edit it with nano you can see that I already have um, the, the the lines installed. I will show you. So um, here you can see uh, the PS2 dev uh, local directory, the PS2 SDK uh, directory, and the path to put all the of the binary files in the, in the same path. So uh, after this, you just well you add the to, to bash RC, uh, then you so you you either source it or you use the dot to uh, to make it uh, run the, the script. After that, you install OKRager okay with uh, Python 3 pip. You can just use pip3 install OKRager. Okay so just close this pip3 install OKRager. Okay and it says it's already installed so I installed it myself um, it's easy if you have pip3 uh, after that you just add this line to bash rc and then you just do the source or the the, the dot with the, the bash rc script if you go here to the to the home directory you can see that it has the very same, um, the very same uh, bash bash rc um, um, part to, that you have to add. So this is for OK Rager. Uh, for mass core, I usually uh, just put it on the desktop. So in my desktop, I just copy these commands. Uh, paste it here and uh, well it's it already exists but I will remove it um, it's removed so I clone it and it's cloning after that I just export uh, must one core to the path of uh, must one core uh, for example, uh, in my case it's uh, mount, c, users, uh, zekushaun and desktop and then I put uh, mast one core. 
so uh, I can use this I can also put it uh, put it on the bash RC and then I use the, the source or the dot but it's easier for me if I do this and uh, well you, you can do the both ways but as long as it, as it's on a, an accessible place you can just do this um, in uh, in, uh, in the GitHub, uh, you uh, it says there that to to use opt, you can use any of the paths available to you. I usually use the the desktop one, so it's easier to me to access the the SDK. So, yeah. Uh, after that, uh, you do this uh, CD must one core uh, samples, and then you just go to do do the sample that you want. For example. PS light bar and you run uh, bash build uh, bash uh, build uh, dot sh and it should build everything for you so you just wait a bit you can see here it's uh, it's uh, signing to to the me to the memory card files now it's doing the PS51 and it's done so yeah this this does all the the three uh, the three uh, possibilities so uh, P P C I C P C A S X uh, two and also P S four and also P S five so yeah then you can just use the 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 card to um, with with either uh, P S four on nine dot zero zero or below hackable. Or uh, save wizard to um, to pass the save to the to the to the well to the to, to the game via via PSN or via whatever whatever uh, firmware you are using with the Apollo save tool. Um, so yeah, you build. You can just you can just use the dot slash build dot sh. So you can, it does the same. Let me just go to another sample. CD PS2 um, Hello World, and then I go here and I just type um, dot slash build dot sh, and it will build the same as uh, I run uh, bash build dot sh. Uh, let me just put. Um, let me just put uh, add this to bash rc and source so yeah this is also required uh, you can also use apollo save tool if you have a hacked console or save wizard if you don't so yeah, this is the the basics of the basics. Um, you can just uh, you can just get it from here. Um, it's a simple tutorial, I think, uh, because you don't have to build the PS2 Dev tool chain. I already do, did that for you. If you want to build the PS2 Dev tool chain, uh, just be aware that it will take uh, a very long time. Uh, even for a computer with uh, multiple uh, with multiple uh, threads and uh, very powerful computers it will still take a very long time so yeah that's all for today i will add all of this to the um, to the description and i hope i will see you guys on the next video